Hello everybody, welcome back to more Elden Ring. Time for us to be dealing with Wyndham Ruins. We're going to be getting ourselves another death route. And at the back of this area is um, a catacomb as well. So we'll go ahead and we'll deal with both of those. So uh, anybody kind of wanting to see this, we are obviously starting out from the Erd Tree Gazing Hill. And we'll be heading up the hill towards where we can see the, uh, the statue ahead. Tibia Mariner is going to be here for us to fight. I'm a little bit under what I need for a level, so we're not going to be... Well, I'm going to have to make sure I don't die to this, basically. Come here, let's give me give me some support here. I'm going to need that. you got to be careful with this guy, because he's going to summon rather large skeletons that like to fire crazies, craziness at you. Um, and there are kind of, like, hidden... Um, hidden, like, groups of skeletons, as you can see. Give me this. Oh, it's gonna be horrible. Where's Luther when I need him? Oh man. There he is. Good job. Good job. I knew I was gonna hurt. Oh, I targeted the wrong thing. How am I not dead yet? That's crazy. I assumed the damage would be way higher than that. No, I'm stuck. I mean, I shouldn't, com I shouldn't uh, comment something like that, because otherwise I'm gonna look silly when I die in a second, but I'm gonna get this thing down. Come on. HP, FP. There are really tons of these skeletons. Luckily, Lootle, though, taking the damage like a champ. Oh. I took damage there like a chump, though. Excuse me. Let's finish you off. It's going to make my life a little easier. Aha. Oh, it knocked all of his dudes down. Well, that works out nicely for me. Well, this went better than I thought it was going to go. Come on, quick. That's very close. We did it. Ha ha. Mm -mm. Give me them runes. Right, now the the main, main loot, if I remember rightly, is in the upper part of the ruins. We're just going to have a quick loop around here. I don't want to miss any little bits of loot that we could have. Loot is still available, which is nice. And grab this. And there should be... I can't remember what's in the cave now. Is it this... Um, feel like, I could be wrong, I feel like in in the uh, locked room we're going to have up here, it's the um, sc Holy Scorpion Talisman. Could be wrong, but I think that's what's in here. Excuse me, sir. No, 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 no. Ooh, you have those. Interesting. Uh, that's a really weird, uh, he's carrying a rare weapon there. Um, if he drops it, it's a good weapon to use. Do you mind? I can use this please, thank you. Lootle's out there somewhere. Defending my honor, I love it. <laughs> okay, it's heading down. Heading down, heading down. I did not remember there being this many in here. It's not going to be a problem. <laughs> Especially with my buddy behind me. Just in time, sir. Just in time. Sir Lutl, proving his value again. Pearl Drake Talisman. No, I was a little bit off. Damn. Not a bad talisman, though. Useful. Useful. Uh, what else do we have around here? What else do we have? I think that's all of it, actually. We can progress to the catacombs next. Yeah, pretty good. Cool. So now we're just going to head on over the hill and far away. Um, straight through. Pretty much should come out the back of here. We should see... 
Where are we? <laughs> oh, you know what I haven't done? I didn't loot that cave in the Sage's Cave. Where you can actually farm the bandit's curve sword. Oh my god. <laughs> so funny. I can't even remember what's in there now. I'm so anybody following this playlist, I'm so sorry. Make sure you go back and loot the uh, the cave at the entrance to Sage's Cave. I completely forgot to do that. Oh my. I'm so sorry. Right, I'm going to do this. I shouldn't. I'm aware. There's, there's been a few people saying they don't understand how I'm um, doing this with so little um, HP. It's because it's fun. Uh, how many seeds do we have to? I need an additional three seeds and we can cap out healing. That's crazy. In any case, into the room, room we go. I've only been through here twice. I can't remember it very well. There's definitely stuff we want in here though, so. Let's make it a good run, shall we? There's probably something on that ledge. There's always this a little bit like with the um the, the tunnels. Sometimes there's good stuff there, sometimes there's not. I've got a sneeze coming. Whew. Let's go with something long range here. Sorry, I was just... Damn it. I completely missed time that. Why? Why do they have such high resistance? Is there only one blade? Okay. Okay, maybe this is where we're going to get the scorpion charm. I bet it's going to be the lightning one. That's what's that's what I'm gonna be getting mixed up with in the uh, interim. Right, let's go through here. Why does that feel like a really short roll? Medium. Why am I me why am I medium load? No, 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 no. How? Oh, I know. It's because we took the uh, thing off for the butterfly. Okay, we need to get more endurance. Okay, no gloves. We're back to uh, needing endurance again. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you? Ha <laughs> ha. Have a have a surprise for you. I knew there was more there than meets the eye. Right. Huh. A different trap, hey? You need to do better than that. I shouldn't attempt it. It's going to do better now, isn't it? Oh, I remember this one. Because we kind of have to fight this guy, because otherwise it just knocks you off the ladder. Oh, I missed the backstab, didn't that time, though? Ho 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 ho! Well, sir, well. No! Backstabbed out the way. Get out. Can Grey Sword got your number? Oh, I'm not wearing the thingy. Let me change that now. Power up. Could we do more damage? <gasps> Trap. Wait a minute. Yeah, I remember you as well. Get up. Damn it. This is one of the fat ones as well. No, there's not. Where is the fat one? I'm sure there's a fat one. No, maybe not. Okay. I thought there was a fat one. I was positive. That one had a friend. Mm. Mm. Ah, there's the scorpion charm. Make sure you get that bad boy. That is essential to any faith build. Uh, this is ah, this is a lift. I remember this bit because there's a dude behind us that wants to uh, catch us out. Let's deal with this guy. Me a loser. I got your number. Oh yeah, now we can one shot you. Excellent. Is there anything underneath it? I can't remember. Yes. Is it the progress way though? I can't remember. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna go straight across. Like so. Yep, yeah, I know we've got this behind us. We have to deal with you now. 
I think the knight can pretty much aggro straight on us, so we have to be careful about what we're looking at here. All right, finish you off. Drink that. And this one definitely has friends. Yes. Ha! <laughs> really? What are you doing? You're making it so I have to aggro the other guy, aren't you? Come here. Nobody wants to do that. There we are. There's no way it's going to let me sneak up with the backstab. I'm going to try it. It did. I'll take that. Come on then. Let's put you down, sir. You fought so valiantly. Excellent. There we go. That's done. Oh, it set off as soon as I jumped. It's a little bugger. Go back down. Yes, there we go. Now I want to do this and roll that way. And we're going down here. Uh, ooh, is this? I remember this. Got a trick here. Right, so we're actually going to clear these zombies out. I like doing this. It's probably not required, but I like this. you. Right, let's get rid of you. You don't want easy in the way. Let's get rid of these. It's probably not going to work for me. I'm probably going to regret it in a second. But I like it anyway. Oh, you've got rot. That looks, like, that looks like rot. We don't want that. Uh, over there, we're going to get some crabs coming out of the water. But there is a trap here that we can use to kill the crabs. I believe this too. Come here. Crab crabs. Yeah. Yeah. Come here. Come here. This is like my favourite thing ever. I love doing this to every enemy in the game wherever possible. Next one. Excuse me. Excuse me, Mr. Krabs. Sometimes, little bits, they just come back to me. <laughs> okay, um, so we have cookbook, we have the talisman, time for Labos. Which is going to be Glovewood Pickers Bell Bearing 3, uh, 1, not 3. Wow, can you imagine if it was 3 already? That'd be crazy. Let's get away with this, we don't want any of this. No, 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 no. Quick rest of the grace and we can deal with the boss. We did this pretty quickly, actually. We did a catacomb and... The uh, actual main window runes in one go. So I guess we'll make our way back up to Seath Water because I was uh, too idiotic to have actually rested at the Grace. Oh, do you have to take this long? Let, let me skip forward a bit. Okay then, back upstairs. Now I can rest at the Grace properly. Good thing here is going to be that. Uh, ooh, we could actually we could get the loot from Sage's Cave as well. Actually, when I think about it, <laughs> being as I completely missed it. For those that wish to see it, I'm looking forward to the complaints already. Right, uh, let's pop you. Here we go. Bring out Lootle. Is it just the one? Is it because it's a lightning one? Is that the oh? This is a lightning uh, a thingy room. Yes. So its attacks are going to have like mega AOE if it strikes with lightning. I hate that it can just do that like forever look, literally forever. Like there is no um, like wind up for an attack. The animation triggers when it decides it wants to trigger. We don't get that option either with a lot of our attacks. Come on. 
Yes! I could have got in for that, but we're gonna just pound instead. Nope. Damn it, nothing that went through. It's over though. There you go. Very little watchdog of mine. Okay, cool. 15 minutes in. Couple of things to clean up. Let's clean up Sage's Cave and reach Seed Water Cave. It's gotta be a thing. So we're gonna come from here. I don't need to go back into rest or anything, so we're just gonna head to Sage's Cave. This should be mega quickly. Okay then, means we're here. Might as well spend my point that I have. We're there. We're, we're almost there. 16 intelligence we need. 16! We can finally use the um, Regal Scepter and that's going to make a world of difference, let me just tell you. Maybe not on the Rock Sling. Mm, we'll have to test it. We could do dual wielding though. We could try dual wielding staffs to have like ridiculous Rock Sling. But then again, you're dual wielding the Meteorite Staff just for Rock Sling really. Mm, I'm sure we can come up with better aggression than that once we do it. So, I completely forgot this. I apologise. I didn't come back. Oh, no, we did do it. Well, I must have done it, should I say. It's open. Was I wrong? In thinking the way I did? I'm going to get killed here. Come on, man. No! Uh, these are mega good to farm, by the way. The weapon they drop is really good. It's the same weapon I was talking about earlier, but still. This one's like mega good, right? Yeah. We've got to do this. Finish them. Like, finish them. Another one down there? No. Good. That sh yeah, we haven't been through here before. There we go. See? There was loot in here. I completely forgot it in the, in the episode we, we dedicated to this place. Um, what did I nearly forget as a part of this walkthrough? Black Hood. Mm -hmm. It's not going to go with my character right now. We're too mid for that. Candle Tree Wooden Shield and... Nothing mega. Uh, which is relieving, but still. We had to do it. So, from here, we should already have the Seathwater River um, Grace, which is where we're going to pick up from next. <clears throat> and from here, we're just going to push north. So, straighten up. Um, I'm going to head for the Seathwater Cave. We should have already looted all this. I think we even got the Ash of War, didn't we? Yes. Let's get some volcanic stones, because why not? Just push past all of this. Up over the side here. Uh, I feel like there is, there's, there's like a, <clears throat> oh man, that had a massive AOE on it. A bit absurd actually. Um, I feel like to the right of the cave, there's a load of basilisks and some loot there, but I don't think it's good loot. It's loot that I can't remember what it is. It's smithing stone five though. Yeah. yeah. Wow, that just appeared out of the ground. My least favourite. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> it's like spreading between the two of them. I'll take that. So, bolluses, empty bone. Anything amazing at all? Nice book, right? Nope. I don't know if natives of butterflies have like the Aeonian quality to them, but it's kind of rare. I bet they do. I haven't really tested what they craft or what they're amazingly good for, but I'll have to have a look at that. Yeah, yeah. This game's always a learning curve. There's always something I'm learning. So anyway, we can head on in, see the water cave. And that puts us in good stead for next episode where we'll be going through here. There we are. Hope you're all enjoying the series, and I'll see you all again soon.